on the track from each team. Um, the blockers are trying to stop the jammer from getting through the pack, and the jammers are trying to weave their way through the pack and score points on the opposing blockers. What you're really watching is the offense and defense of both teams trying to get their girl through and stop the other girl at the same time. It's a full contact sport. We're trying to stop girls from passing us, and so it's when we put them on the floor. I mean, I'm not by any means a big girl, and um, when you see, like, you know, probably cumulatively a few hundred pounds coming at you of, of girl. You know, it, it's kind of intimidating. Some of these girls are really big and they hit really hard and so you have to be able to take it and dish it right back out. It takes a lot out of you physically. I can say though, I mean, I'm going to be 31 next month and I've had two kids and I'm probably in the best shape of my life and it's because of roller derby. I think that it's one of the first times, at least that I can think of, where women have really taken the reins on defining a new sport. When I started in 05, there were about 30 leagues known in the world. And then it just kind of started to snowball and snowball and now there's, I think, I want to say 1,200 known leagues on six continents in scores of countries. So every year it's gotten more and more competitive, it's gotten more serious. Fighting went out a long time ago, you won't see fake fights. And we pay dues to be here, so we're not going to pay dues and, you know, sweat and give our blood and tears and everything else just to come out and roll around on the ground with another chick in a tutu, like that's just silly. We want to win, and we come and we play to win. They've kind of become like my sisters, and leaving them would be like leaving part of your family. It's like a, it's kind of like a sorority in a way, but we're like the sorority rejects that didn't really fit in with the sorority look. Okay, okay, let's try that. We all get along really well. We have a grievance committee that I don't even think has done anything in a couple of years. You know, if you want to have tattoos, you can have tattoos. If you're a, you know, clean cut girl, that's fine too. Like, we'll take anybody. Nobody's really stopping you from expressing yourself however you want to express yourself. I think that in a lot of ways, like, that defines feminism. You can just do whatever you want, be who you want to be, and um, nobody's going to judge you for it. It's really, it's really changed me totally for the better. Just like, it's cliche to say now, but roller derby really does save your soul. <laughs> roller derby's for everybody, it's awesome.